Well, I think it defines success in, in many ways. Um, uh, I didn't win a Stanley Cup. Am I disappointed? Heck yeah, I'm disappointed. Uh, you know, I played 21 years to try to hold that cup above my head, but it wasn't in the cards for me. It's not going to define me as a player or a person. Uh, certainly, it's disappointing. Every t year I watch the Stanley Cup Finals and I see the captain raising that cup and it goes around. You know, there's a little sore spot. But I've had success in other, um, on other teams, the 96 World Cup, uh, just recently coaching the World Junior Team to a gold medal. So um, I think there's areas uh, that you can achieve that not everybody's going to win a Stanley Cup, but you can't, you can't dwell on that. Uh, I just remember a good story, you know, in the 1998 uh, Olympic team, you know, I wasn't picked for that team. And I, and I, I was really disappointed because uh, Ron Wilson, who was my head coach in Washington, I thought would have a, a big uh, part in picking me, but it was actually the GMs that picked the team. Um, I didn't hold that against anybody. I used it for motivation. You had four more years to wait. Uh, I made the 2000 team. 2002 Olympic team in Salt Lake. I uh, was fortunate enough to score the winning goal against the Russians in the semis. Didn't win the gold medal, but when I look back at that, it's a great learning lesson for people. Uh, if you don't succeed, you got to use that as motivation so when you get in that circumstance again, you can succeed. And I think overall that was a success for me, uh, and I, I'm really proud of that.